everybody, Cynthia here. <clears throat> I changed my batteries out of my camera, so we're good to go. I'm going to share with you the, um, the Christmas one I made. And I used this Recollections paper pad, Bright and Jolly. And it has a ton. It's a 180 sheet paper pad. Although I've used a lot of this up already, um, has a ton of different patterns. It's really, really cute. I don't know if they still sell this or not. It's pretty, I, I mean, I had this one in my, my uh, stash for a while and I don't see what year it's from. No, I don't. But, oh yeah, 2011. So, like I said, it's been around for quite a while. But, um, it's cute. It's more cutesy, I think. And, um, so I used some of those papers. And here's my little mini I'm addicted to. I have blue seam binding, red, and green lace. And then I made this bead of charm that has little jingle bells and a light bulb at the end. And um, I used my, my bind it all. Then I made three rosette flowers and put snowflakes in the middle with some leaves that I cut out with my Bitty Blossom Spellbinder die. And then these were part of a kit that I cut out and used. It says Believe. I have a doily in the background. I fussy cut two penguins from the paper and did some ho 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 um, corner pieces. So that's my cover. And this is the inside. Very simple. Two photo mats. says magical with a little stocking. And your photo will slide behind there. And then I have another I mean clip. <laughs> and a warm wishes tag for more photos. Nice area for a photo here. And then I just did some edging there with some laces and my Martha Stewart punch and I have Santa Claus and then this is the first pull out and the second has one of the photo frames that you could just slide that out it says celebrate and there's a little snowflake with a bride there and then this page has a Christmas tree embellishment another clip and then this slides behind there and then there's two tags most wonderful time of the year and a journal spot with a photo spot and then a nice area for a photo and another pull out but see the pa the paper's cutesy it has like little elves and santas and penguins throughout the paper and here I made another photo mat with a reindeer and I have a little glove embellishment that this just slides behind and then there's a nice area for a photo and I have a pocket here with I think this was a Kane Company chipboard um, soldier and this ticket here that says better not pout and then another photo mat and then a nice area for a photo again and this is the next pull out and then the next page this is really cute it has a snowman and a bird and a little penguin that says North Pole and then I just use this little ticket here to embellishment as an embellishment except that the paper was so cute and then this says no peeking and there's two areas for photos there and another pull out and then the next page just has gloves and a little snowflake embellishment here, which, you know, your photos can slide behind, which I can't get it on there right now. But, And then I have a photo mat on the back page with um, some decorations here and another journal spot. So I already have one created for one of my friends for Christmas. I'm so excited because it's only September and I'm already getting a head start. And the reason why is because I have so many things I need to make people and things I need to do. I don't want to get behind. So I thought if I'd start these early, I might be able to get the amount done that I need to, to do. So <laughs> anyway, you guys have any questions, let me know. Thanks so much for watching. Take care.